hi everyone welcome back to my channel today we are going to make coconut sweet bread a very popular bread in the Caribbean and it is so delicious so today I'm using two cups of flour so let's begin and I let you know all the ingredients along the way so I have two teaspoon of baking powder so I'm going to pour it in and give that a good mix I love this so much guys one of my favorite too so now I'm going to add my coconut and I'm using one and a quarter cup of coconut and half cup of sugar put that inside Give that a good mix. And I'm using half cup of mixed fruits. One third cup of raisins. And feel free to add more or less fruits and I'm using one eighth cup of cherry I'm, I'm not too much of a fan of a cherry so this is good for me and I'm using quarter cup of room temperature butter this butter contains a little percentage of salt so that's why you see I'm not using salt today let's pour that in And one teaspoon of cinnamon and half teaspoon of nutmeg. So let me give that a good mix. Mix that in real good. We eat this around Christmas time a lot too. And throughout the year, very delicious. Make sure everything blend in well. And I'm using one and a half cup of evaporated milk. If you don't want to use the evaporated milk, go right ahead and use some coconut milk, some water. You can do that. So I'm going to pour in my milk little by little. And we don't want to over mix this, okay? Because it's gonna get hard and, I, and you don't want that just pour a little more in there see let it get in a good look Can't forget my vanilla extract it was hiding <laughs> and I'm using one teaspoon of vanilla extract oops we just mix that right in and not too much of mixing okay great this is ready to go in the baking pan and this is the consistency you are looking for so I'm going to pour it into my baking pan and bake at 350 for an hour 15 minutes I'll make sure let you know the accurate time when it's finished after it's finished I'm going to put some sugar water on it just to give it a nice shine And remember no over mixing let me get the additional foods so this is some additional foods that I'm going to pour on top just for decoration <laughs> and that's a custom we do 
and I'm going to put some cherries and some raisins, sprinkle some raisins and some mixed fruits this is going to be so delicious guys I can't wait Okay, so let me put this in the oven to bake. So the coconut sweet bread is ready and I bake it at 350 degrees for an hour 10 minutes. And remember to insert your knife and if it comes out clean that means it finished. So I'm gonna glaze it with some sugar water. My grandmother used to use a little plastic bag and just glaze it on top. But I'm using a brush. My God, my house is smelling so amazing. And when it's finished cooling, I'll cut a slice for you. So the coconut sweet bread has cooled down and I'm going to cut you a slice. Look at this. Drink this with a cup of coffee or a cup of tea. You're good to go. Thank you for watching guys and don't forget to subscribe and the recipe will be in the description section. Thank you again for watching.